Good afternoon. Welcome to Greensboro, North Carolina, home of Next GA Aircraft. I'm William Bird, and today we're here to look at a beautiful, low time 2007 Columbia 350 SLX, which is fully loaded and has a lot of great equipment. Let's take a look. Total time on 1411 Golf is 950 hours, total time since factory new. The engine also has 950 hours on it since new. It's the Platinum Edition Continental IO550N 310 horsepower engine rated at 2,000 hours TBO. Now this engine has also been upgraded and equipped with the forced Aeromotive Technologies super normalizing system. So this engine is supercharged, giving you better performance. The Columbia 350 also uh, includes a tuned induction and exhaust system. The prop has been recently overhauled. It has about 120 hours on it since prop overhaul, and this engine has been topped with brand new cylinders about 120 hours ago as well. 1411 Golf is equipped with a full TKS DI system, including a hot prop. This TKS system is great to get you out of an inadvertent ice and encounter. This 350 is also equipped with speed brakes. Now, speed brakes are an excellent resource for a pilot to have. Uh, they allow you to get down quickly or slow down in the pattern without having to chop power. The Columbia 350 is a very fast and economical aircraft to operate. This one especially so because it's equipped with the super normalizing system. Now this is a gear driven system that allows you to get as much performance as possible out of this engine. It increases your climb performance to close to 15 feet per minute and it adds about 10 to 15 knots in cruise. It allows you to get higher speeds in the uh, you know, low teen altitudes, 10, 12, 14,000 feet. It's an excellent system. The Columbia 350 is a composite airplane, yes, but Columbia uses much more carbon fiber throughout its design than comparable composite aircraft. For instance, the ailerons are all carbon fiber, the cowling is carbon fiber, and the dual wingtip to wingtip spars are carbon fiber. Now carbon fiber is about five times stronger than comparable steel, and each of these spars alone could withstand the utility category loads of this aircraft. That's how well this aircraft is engineered. But you have 98 gallons of usable fuel, which gives you a range of well over 1,300 nautical miles. Take a look at the paint and the exterior condition of 1411 Golf. Overall, it's in great condition. There's a lot of sheen and shine in the paint. There's a few paint chips um, in the standard areas, such as the uh, nose wheel paint. It could use a little bit of touch up, but overall, it's in great condition. It's a beautiful black pearl with silver stripe and white overall. The Columbia 350 provides ample baggage space. You can fit up to 120 pounds back there as long as you keep the airplane within CG. You can get 20 pounds on the hat shelf and it includes a, a, a nice uh, cargo net for you back there. You can also take that bar out and fold the seats down and treat the aircraft like an SUV. Let's take a look at the interior condition of 1411 Golf. It's in great condition. Features the Oregon Aero sport seats, which are very comfortable. The side walls are in great condition. The side walls as well, the seats are, are beautiful buckskin tan leather. The headliner is in great condition as well. And you can see I'm almost six feet tall. I have plenty of headroom. I have plenty of leg room. It's a very comfortable ride. I've spent over four hours on the back of a Columbia, and I can tell you it's very comfortable back here. This 350 is equipped with precise flight, four place, semi-portable oxygen. Now this bottle can be bracketed here between the seats where it is right now, or you can actually take it out of the bracket and put it in the back seat or the front seat or store it in the baggage for when you don't want to use it. 1411 Golf has an excellent panel featuring the Garmin G1000 and a lot of other great upgrades. Let's take a look. 1411 Golf features an excellent Garmin G1000 system with the GFC 700 Autopilot. Let's take a look at the PFD. Here at the top left we have our NAV1, NAV2 frequencies. In the center we have trip information. To the right we have our COM1, COM2 active and standby frequencies. Here's our airspeed tape with V speeds. In the center is our attitude indicator and inclinometer. To the right 
we have our altitude and vertical speed indicator. And to the bottom left, we have our inset. This is programmable. I like to keep it on traffic. In the center, we have our slaved HSI with GPS and VLOC 1 and 2 modes. And you can see we have our true airspeed displayed here. You can see we also have synthetic vision. This also includes highways in the sky, which is great for situational awareness and when you're shooting an approach. Now this Columbia 350 is equipped with a GFC 700 autopilot. Now this digital autopilot is probably the best autopilot in general aviation. It features altitude, pre-select, vertical speed pre-select, heading, GPSS steering, and it will shoot a fully coupled approach down to minimums. Take a look at the multi-function display on this G1000 equipped 350. Here we also have our NAV1, NAV2 active and standby frequencies, more trip, trip information here in the center. And to the right we have our COM1, COM2 uh, active and standby frequencies, just like we do on the PFD. Here we have our engine instrumentation. Here to the left include a manifold pressure RPM, fuel quantity gauges, uh, fuel flow, oil pressure, oil temperature, our highest EGT in temperature and our highest CHT in temperature. You also see that we have our trim information here. Here we have our map page. You can see that we have a uh, trip plan to Myrtle Beach. If we go to the right, here's our traffic page. Now this system is equipped with the Ryan 9900BX 24 nautical mile active traffic system. Here we have our storm scope. Now the owner upgraded uh, this G1000 system with the TWX670 Avidine tactical weather. So this shows not only NEXRAD uh, information but real-time storm scope weather so you can see convective activity in real time as soon as it's happening. And here we have our weather data link page. This is equipped with uh, XM weather. And here's our TOSB. You can see it's all red because we're on the ground. To the right we have our waypoint page which shows a lot of great information including runway information, frequencies. Here's our aux page which includes XM radio and our flight plan page. You can see that we have a uh, simple flight plan to Myrtle Beach and our nearest page. One great thing about the G1000 system is when you're in flight it will actually show you uh, vectors to your nearest airport. So it's really intuitive. If you need to get somewhere quick, it will give you the turn to, uh, to your vector. And to the far right, we have our system page. Now the Columbia 350 with the G1000 system has a full page dedicated to digital instrumentation. You can see we have our oil information here, manifold RPM, <clears throat> our fuel flow, our left and right fuel quantity gauges. We also have a fuel calculator. To the bottom left we have our EGT, all six temperatures, and to the right we have all six of our CHT temperatures. Our electrical information is included here. The Columbia 350 has a fully redundant uh, electrical system, so you have two alternators, two batteries, and two buses. And we also have tri uh, trim information here. This 350 also includes lean assist, which will help you lean out the airplane in flight. One outstanding feature that most owners really love about the G1000 equipped Columbia 350 is this Columbia Ready Pad, which communicates directly with your PFD and MFD. You can switch which one you want to control, and uh, this allows you to just type in information instead of knobbing through, you know, intersections and and waypoints. Um, it's, it's really great for in-flight and turbulence. Instead of reaching all over the panel, you can do everything right here from this ready pad. 1411 Golf was sold as an SLS package, so it has all the great equipment, and one of those great upgrades is the Columbia Digital Climate Control System featuring air conditioning. Now this is an outstanding system that really cools the cabin down. It, uh, the system rivals most luxury automobiles. It's a set and forget system and it will cool the cabin down 20 degrees in only five minutes. One feature of the Columbia 350 that most owners really love 
is the dual side stick controls. Now you're directly linked to your control surfaces with lifetime push rod controls. There's no spring, cable, or pulleys here. It's a, it's a very intuitive system that makes the aircraft really fun to fly. It centers over one point here, so it's very intuitive and has a nat natural uh, wrist position. It also features four-place trim, an autopilot disconnect and control wheel steering switch. If you want a great buy on a very nice, very well-equipped, fully loaded Columbia 350 SLX that's had excellent maintenance history, has no damage history, has been well cared for, and is equipped with the digital climate control, full TKS de-icing system, and every upgrade that was available from the factory at the time, including active traffic, uh, and a lot of excellent other upgrades, including synthetic vision and real-time storm scope, then you need to give us a call at 336-665-0300 or visit our website at www.nextga.com, that's N-E-X-G-A.com, to take a look at this beautiful aircraft and all our other next-generation aircraft. Thanks for watching and have a great day.